evening, everybody. Welcome to Tuesday in Night Right. How is everybody doing tonight? Let me know in the chat what you guys got going on. And I'm going to let my co-hosts for tonight introduce themselves. We're going to swing it around starting with Alora and clockwise around. Let's go. Hello. Hello. Um, I'm Laura Nettles. My channel is Laura Nettles. I do things spooky and scary and now also vampire romancy so that is fun i'm here <laughs> and roy oh, wants attention so short hi i'm author jc carpenter i have books and make videos i do the things um i stream on wednesdays from 7 to 9 p.m eastern standard time that's me Lovely Morgan, who has a book coming out December. <laughs> Hello, everyone. My name is Morgan Lee. Um, I am an author. I have a dark fantasy trilogy. Book one is already available. Book two will be coming out on December sixteenth. Uh, so be on the lookout for that. I do streams Monday mornings at eight a.m. Central Time, and that's it. Hello, everybody. I am Tiffany TMS Lifestyle. Um, I have a uh, Kofi. I have a Kindle Bella. I have a story coming out on my Kofi for the holiday. And um, I stream on Thursdays. PJs and Scribbles coming out with us. It's fun. And I am Nita Vixen of Fiction. You are here on my channel. I'm here every Tuesday night at 7 p.m. Um, the couple things I have coming up, uh, I've got the book club is doing How the Grinch Stole Christmas on Sunday, the 18th at noon. So come hang out with us for that. And then at the end of the month on Friday, the 30th, we are going to do um, author tubers react. We're going to have like a, a kind of like a yearly wrap up. It should be fun. So you can come hang out with us for that as well. I'm going to say hi to the folks that came in. Hello, Nick. Uh, and thank you. Yes. Subscribe to all my fabulous co-hosts. They're all linked below. And make friends with people in the chat if you're new or if a new person comes in. Follow folks. Everybody's nice here. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> you should subscribe. Thank you. Oh, thank you, Nick. Yes. And subscribe to Nick. Nick is awesome. Also, <laughs> yes. And Jennifer Brown is here. Hello, Jennifer. Shannon, hello, hello. I know it's getting late for Shannon. Hi, Regina. How are you? Everybody's saying hi to everybody, which I love. Um, hello, Essie. How are you doing? Cool Gamer is also here. I see JC was hanging out in the chat. Hi, Caitlin. How are you doing? Good to see you. Becca is here. Hi, Becca. How are you doing? Um, you guys, um, uh, Essie's going well, oh, she's responding because everybody, I, I love a good chatty chat when the chat is going to the chatty thing. The same way of breaking for dinner. Yes, we just did the dinner thing. Um, it, it was like a mad rush, too, because some of our lights, we ordered, like, you know, the little light up reindeer. So our the ones that we've had for like the last 10 years, we've been started having to jerry rig the neck together. You know how the neck's supposed to move or rotate. It's been breaking the last couple of years. So we were like, you know, kind of like hooking wiring it together to make it make it work. So last year we threw all of the old stuff that was broken out and I had to wait for Black Friday to get new stuff. So it's like, oh, the stuff is finally here. So we got new deer. I'm so happy. But yeah, you got to do the Black Friday sales because this stuff is not cheap right now. It's been fascinating. Um, let me know, you guys, what is everybody going to be working on tonight? Hello, Sam. Um, yeah, I'm, I think I'm going to be diving back into my vampire romance. All right. Um, on chapter 22. Nice, nice. What you doing, JC? You got, got work to do tonight? I don't know yet. <laughs> She's undecided. <laughs> <sighs> At least you're smiling. You look so adorable with a big old happy grin. <laughs> Make me blush. <laughs> 
<laughs> what are you up to tonight, Morgan? Um, I just got um, my manuscript back from the proofreader. So I'm going to probably go through that and then upload. Well, I probably won't get through it tonight, but I'm going to go through it and then upload it on to KDP for the pre-order. Very Yay. cool. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. Yeah. And Tiffany, what are you working on? Uh, probably edits. Very cool. Um, I feel like also, I guys, Tiffany just did a Notion. If you guys are wanting to get into Notion for the new year, she just did a video, a live stream. So you can go check out her channel and get some really cool tips. Uh, Des and I were talking in the chat, like we're going to have to like watch it like over and over. <laughs> just like go along, make sure we get everything. Oh, my I tried goodness. my best. I feel like such a you, slacker today. Too crazy. <laughs> No, and then, then all at the end, all working all work. <laughs> yeah, but Tiffany at the end was all, don't worry if yours is not going to look exactly like someone who's been doing it for a long time. And I'm like, but, but that's exactly what I want. <laughs> I want all the bells and whistles and I want it to be all shiny and perfect and have like all of, all of the things. And she's like, yeah, it's going to take you a while. I'm like, oh, <laughs> it does, but it's. Fun Which is probably around. why I haven't yeah. even started trying. <laughs> yeah. Um, Beck is working on screenplay, uh, sketching out 22. Oh, yes, Caitlin, yes. Oh, I'm I'm all for it. How many chapters is the story, Laura? JC. At least 30. At least I like that. That's gonna be that's gonna be some good reading. <laughs> she could take her time, right? I know, but now I, I feel like I'm a slacker because they're all working on like work, and I'm just like, oh, I suppose. I but I haven't it. written really since <laughs> Nano. That's kind of like scaring me a little bit. Like I, I'm like, oh no, is is this that thing that everybody says happens after Nano where you don't want to write anything? Like I literally just want to do journal crafting stuff for my journal and do artwork and read. Yeah, I literally, I don't want to write. Oh no, this is really a thing. I wrote a lot of words though. Like I wrote like over Pick 60, something simple. I think I just need the week. I think I just need the week. I've been journaling too. Like it's yeah. been fun. Yes. So. That is all I want to do. Yeah. That right. You there. could always do like short stuff like um like flash or a short story or something like that. That might get you back in the mood. Yeah. Maybe because nothing Nothing short I ever do ends up being short. So. I was Maybe. about to say. Uh, <laughs> well, I've gotten about 300 well, words. Just turned into another novel idea. Oh. Hi, Jess. How are yeah. you? I took a break and wrote a Drabble for a Dark Moments submission. So I haven't written many word-wise this week so far. I usually do that too, Caitlin. But for some reason, I have two drafts to finish. So yeah, I feel like it like would be a good idea to take the whole month off. I just feel like it wouldn't be a good idea. <laughs> I feel like I need to make this a thing. Because I feel like it was hard for me to get started last year, but I did World Anvil, or the uh, World Ember for World Anvil. This mm -hmm. year, I wanted to do World Anvil, but I literally don't want to write anything, so I haven't. So either I'm going to, I don't know. I don't know. I just, I don't know. <laughs> I feel like I'm so far behind now because we're right. almost totally yeah. in. But Mia, let's just let's let's both of us take the week then so you won't feel alone. We'll take the week. Okay. So we'll then just do just artsy stuff and crafty stuff. And then you know we'll come and back. And then to the Friday, week. Friday hit it, hit it with the well, I don't know about Friday. I was thinking. Yeah, about but that's like, like a week. week. Oh, take an extra week. You're saying take no, an I extra week. Like, <laughs> no, well because December started on Thursday. Oh shoot. Look, yeah, so the I didn't so like okay, so we'll start like, back on we'll start We're back again on Thursday on Tiff's we'll, we'll, we'll do that. So that means we have I'm today not... and tomorrow. Okay, and that's it. And then I have to get back to writing something. All right. I'm, I'm okay, but hold on. I don't that makes it sound like we have to be productive on mine. I wasn't positive we were gonna be productive on mine. Well, now there's this obligation thing that's coming. But this is just me and Nia. It has nothing to do with anybody else. It's me and Nia. Yeah, I really do have things I got to get done. So I dislike procrastination. Whatever this thing is, this post nano thing, it's not a good thing. <laughs> yeah, I really do need to be writing something. 
Good morning, Ann. Hello. Hi, I'm glad you can make it. I sent the link to you at noon, which I'm like, oh gosh, that's midnight for you. So I was like, ah. that's okay. I saw it when I woke up and I was like, yes, but I need to like wake up first. <laughs> awesome, awesome. Thank you. All right. Somebody's walking through the hall, so forgive Loki. So sorry. Um, can you just live really to just really? <laughs> YouTube is a little YouTube does awesome. us dirty. It really does. <laughs> ah, that is a good idea too. Just switch to something different, different format. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then more saying hi, Deidre. Hey, I hope everything is going well for you. Barrett, also hello, hello, hello. Um, I just do. Don't What's know what odd I is all I want to do is plan what I'm supposed to work on for. Years. I know. <laughs> I just want to plan things. Aww. Yeah, I feel like I always miss people coming in because StreamYard jumps and I'm like, oh, I don't want to miss anything important. I don't want to miss saying hi to anybody. Um, very sleepy. Oh, you know what? I do that on Thursdays when I come from work and it's Tiffany streaming. Like the first, whatever the first sprint when I get home, that's always like my shower sprint. Like I need it. Logie, nobody is talking to you. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be seen. He's like, well, that's the problem. Nobody is talking. Probably. Exactly. Loki's like, you haven't uh, addressed me. I haven't okay, said hello to so. my fans. <laughs> okay. Yes, let um, us see the boy. Yes, the slump <laughs> is real, Regina. Okay, let me grab him really quick. I really need to. Okay, you guys take it, take it away. Y'all know what to do. I'm not going to have my hand. <laughs> And I need to pull up the timer. <laughs> Hi. Oh. There he is. Oh, hello. Oh, he's a little eye. Yeah, I know. <laughs> My daughter is so funny. She found one of his scarves from the 4th of July and put it on him like a cape. So like, <laughs> and then he started posing and she's like, what's he doing? I said, he's legit sitting there waiting for you to take pictures of him. She's like, no way. So she just pretended like she's taking pictures and he's looking this way. Then he looks this way. Then he does this. And she's like, are you kidding? My son walks in with his phone and says, don't take real pictures of him. <laughs> he loved it. I'm like, yeah. Oh my God. But so to be fair, to be fair, I got him during july camp nano so i was streaming a lot so as soon as i got him he immediately was like oh we do this thing on camera all the time Aww. so yeah okay. it's this thing all right let me find child star. Do, do, do. Oh. Lauren, did i you think see what nick will be reading tonight yeah mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> And okay, pause. No, we're not ready. Pause, pause, pause. Because you know, I'll have the timer running behind the thing, and then it's like whatever time we start on. So we're going to start with the Loki timer, but then we're going to move on to um, we've got a Tiffany timer and a Laura timer that we're going to do. So we're going to do 30, 45, and the last one, I'm not sure. It depends on. Oh, Laura's got the new 25, though. That one I love. It's so pretty. So we might do 30, 45, and wait, who's 40? Tiffany, yours is the 45, right? Ah. Okay, 45. I got to plan this right. That's a 45. Let me make sure I have it on my thing. Okay, so I have a little. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. If I do this one of Tiffany's, it's a 45. <laughs> And then do the new one from Laura, which I have not used yet. It's the gold one. It's really, really pretty. All right. So that's what we're going to do. So we're going to start with Loki. Stop growling at me. I didn't mean you, you. I meant I knew you. <laughs> He's so vocal tonight. I'm like, what is going on, Loki? Why are you being so mean to me? Oh my gosh. I like whatever the acorn month. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't have any December goals. That's I need to be like, just, mm -hmm. yeah, just no goals. Just December is here. <laughs> this is the thing. Yeah. <laughs> just December, December, December goal is survive December. 
Yeah. Right. Oh, yes. Yes. It's that part. <laughs> yes. Resting and reading. You guys are doing so much. Like, resting and reading, taking See, December off. And I'm, like, yes. <laughs> I'm debating on reading instead. <laughs> oh, yes. Ooh, I do want to finish some books before the end of the year. Let's just all take the rest of the week off from writing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, maybe not all. <laughs> Like, some people are like, I wish I could, but I think I have deadlines. <laughs> All right. So we are going to get our 30 minutes in. If you guys are ready, enjoy the sprint. Happy sprinting. Hi, Loki. Okay, we're back in business. Oh, hold on. Yay. Picking up right where we left off.
I really need to time it better when I decide to shove a snack in my mouth. <laughs> I was not looking at the timer. Mm. How did everybody do? <laughs> Good. <laughs> I <laughs> I made and ate dinner and I read two chapters. Awesome. Nice. Oh, I mainly nice. just did like some admin stuff, like check my emails, open my document, but I didn't write anything yet. <laughs> and your document is a good start. Yes, mm -hmm. more than what I did, so yay. <laughs> I had a bowl of cereal, which was my dinner, and um, I am making the grocery list because tomorrow's grocery shopping day. Yay! I read through a chapter. And it's um, from the edits, the final edits that you got back? Mm-hmm. Like from so that book that you're releasing on December 16th? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know the trailer that everyone should go check out on her on Morgan's channel. Is fantastic. Yes, I, I read some too. too. We got popcorn. Oh, nice. I'm reading a Junji Ito. Oh, ah, yeah. Oh, so pretty Ooh. with the cover. Yeah, so it came out last month. Last oh, month? that's the month before. That's the one that came out. Yeah. Yeah. How are you liking it? Good. Um, it's it's interesting. <laughs> so, is this, is this the one that's not scary? The one that's not scary is the one about his own cats. Oh, okay. So. <laughs> But um, yeah, no, so this one is about people who get together so they can unalive. Okay, and, so uh, scary. Yes, oh. but each of them has been seeing their own doppelganger for a while. And so like one of them, she sees it in mirrors. The other one, a robot was built to look like him at a university. And another oh. one um, has just seen the doppelganger walking around. And the girl just has premonitions and anxiety and feels like some terrible things are going to happen. And it, it goes from there. Oh, okay. Yeah, I love that. Like the building a robot. That's so cool. Yeah. Just to like I'm fuck with someone like this. No, like, like, <laughs> build this doppelganger of you so that you feel anxiety. <laughs> no, so I they love... built it for like science to, oh, okay. to be awesome. And then the human guy that it was modeled after felt obsolete. Oh, oh I love that. Okay, yeah. yes. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. And I missed earlier a coffee, um, coffee Create Connect came by. Hello, thank Yay. you for stopping by. Hopefully you can come back again. Um, let me see. Um, did everybody in the chat put what they did before I go back and answer what everybody's go-to holiday drink is? Um, we had a couple more people came in because Kelly came in and we chatted in the chat. Um, mm -hmm. Jabria also and Stephanie. Hello, hello. Um, I I really hate it when I miss people. I know Joanne Grayson's came in. I just came in. Oh, Grayson's bookmark. Hello. I am looking for it, but I can't find it. It's three years. Seven fifty one. Seven fifty one. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Eight fifty one. Oh, eight. Sorry. Is it? Okay, oh, it's, it's not. Seven fifty one on mine. Oh. Okay. Oh, yeah, there oh is, wait, yeah. sorry. Yeah, I'm an hour okay, ahead. Right, right. I got it. I was hey, like, wait, I'm yeah, ahead of time. <laughs> yeah, I don't like to, I hate it when I miss when someone comes in and I'm like, oh, how long were you here? And I never said hi. <laughs> and hello, finished creating and editing infograph slides for Instagram. Ooh. Nice. Yes. Oh, yeah. Very good. Do the social media thing. We've got to do it. Um, I believe we said hi to our good friend, Des, who came in. Yeah, snack with me. It's fine. It's all good. I I don't need to speak. I just need to eat. 
Um, yeah, and I think I yeah, I definitely mentioned that Kelly came by and let me go to what Jess is still editing her video for tomorrow. Oh, that's right. Yes. So stay tuned, everybody. Also, Des should is probably linked below. So if you're not following Des, do it. Um Elise just came in. Hello. Let me get to it. Let me get to it. The update. Why I do I not see it? You know what? She hates missing, missing, missing people. I so. do hate yeah, missing yeah, people. No, but <laughs> I'll be moving it and StreamYard will just like move. I'm like, I swear I'm not. I'm it not. Now that. I know. It's so Why? funny now to know what everyone meant back when I wasn't streaming and they would say stream yard junk and I'm like is it really that bad and it was like oh, <laughs> it really is you oh, okay now I get it, it to, <laughs> yes you can be moving it to where you need to be let go of it and then it just moves back to wherever it wants to go and it's just like why I was right there where I needed to be it's it's yeah it is that bad for, for real all right so I have some answers because Deidre is like spiked hot cocoa spiked anything <laughs> Um, either hot chocolate with whipped cream or a mold apple cider from Joanne. I do like, I like a sparkling apple cider. Um, and I pretty much like any hot chocolate that's got whipped cream on it or marshmallows. Like really marshmallows right, right around this time of year though. You know what? Or whipped cream. You know what? Either. Yeah. yeah I'm, a, I'm a whipped cream person. Yeah. I like it. Jennifer says a peppermint hot chocolate. Yum. It's so funny because normally I don't like peppermint, like other than like having it as a mint. I don't mm -hmm. like it like with chocolate or anything or like with a cookie or anything like that. But right around Christmas time, it's like it's acceptable. My taste buds say yes. <laughs> yes. yes it is now Never. time for your chocolate and minty Never. things. I'm like, I don't know why. I don't, I don't know why. Oh. <laughs> Roy said, I will not be ignored. Will not be <laughs> oh, hi, Roy. Oh, y'all. Oh, thank God. <laughs> hi. He's like, you see me? You see me? <laughs> Regina, I think it was Roy whining. <laughs> yeah, Loki is snoring. So that one was that one was Roy this time. Um, let's see. Just Eva just likes a hot cocoa. Yeah. I feel good. that. I feel like I can do anything I want with a hot cocoa. So I, mm -hmm. I feel that. Um, toffee nut latte. Ooh, coffee. <laughs> what a surprise. Yeah. That anything could take. <laughs> um, since I'm cutting back on the coffee, I'm starting to drink a lot of tea, ginger apple tea this week. Nice. I drink a lot of tea because I don't drink coffee. So it's mostly tea and then the occasional hot chocolate. But this time of year, the definitely uptick in the hot hot cocoa and hot chocolate drinks. Yeah. Matcha Valencia. Nice. Stephanie says a hot chocolate or apple cider. Yeah, I think that's um people like the hot chocolate and the apple cider over the holidays. Mm -hmm. Cocoa. Maybe yes, dark, dark chocolate. chocolate. I'm an eggnog girl. I like eggnog as a holiday drink. And so Nick. does Nick, but Nick likes it it's with a little bit no, of adult no. liquid. <laughs> <laughs> was like, was like, not with the alcohol, but with you with the eggnog. <laughs> what about you guys? What do you guys like? What's your go-tos? Ooh, can I show? Can I talk about mine with a prop? It's like right behind yeah, you. Yeah, you have I love that tea. Yeah. So you like, um, it has like a different tea for every like day. And I've been like drinking, it's so nice. Well, like it's every time. I know, and it's like a single. Like, like, is but it's like, like one tea bag in each door. Oh, <laughs> I like, love it. Is that like the almost the Australian version? Well, actually, no, because Sips Buy isn't like that. Um, no, it's it a it's from a brand called Me Too. But yeah, just a sip to the. But yeah, I've been loving this. Like just having some tea every day. Oh. It's so nice. Yay. Is it a subscription yeah. thing or do you just you like no you I just went and bought it like it's just okay. a, like the brand like sells advent calendars so interesting Tiffany lit up when you showed <laughs> <that. laughs> like, <laughs> up she's like I need the website information now <laughs> did you get? this one's Australian but I'm sure there's like non-Australian versions yeah but yeah I did an advent calendar last year 
And if it wasn't for the fact that I have probably about half of it left over from last year, I was going to do it again this year. But um, I find that when I mix in like my regular teas, like I end up with some left over. So yeah, like even this morning, I had one that I didn't even try last year. So yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's some that I haven't, like, had yet for my admin calendar, and some that I probably, like, won't have because I don't like them or something, but I'll just, like, give them to other people, so. Yeah, okay. that's right. I usually do my yeah. own because I, mm-hmm. A weird question for you tea lovers. Does tea go, like, does it go bad? Like, if you have tea from, like, a year or so or whatever, it like. It lose its flavor. Yeah, I think it loses, because okay. I notice it, if you, especially if you take it out of the box, like the box, like I have one, I forget what it's called, but I've had it for a couple of years. It still smells really strong when you open the box. It's some type of a apple and something. Ooh. I forget what it is, but it, and it's, I, I actually just had one for when I did my advent last year or last month and it still mm-hmm. tasted really good it probably would have tasted stronger if it wasn't you know if it if it was newer but i do keep it in the box and when you open the box you can it smells so good so so also depends on if you have tea bags or if you have loose leaf tea loose leaf i don't really loose leaf tea can go bad but it also like they say that it's best to keep it in like either a um, like darker container that protects it yeah. from the sun or out of the light because it'll make it start to lose flavor. Because oh, yeah. I was obsessed with tea one Christmas and I just went and bought a whole bunch of loose leaf tea and had it for like three years and I was like, should I throw away this tea? But it was Wait. in like airtight containers, so I was like, I would think it's like seasoning, like seasoning goes. Cool. <laughs> I love how you said like one Christmas, hard. like yeah that. After that Christmas, I was done with it. I, was I, like, I was. I still like like I, I like tea, but I was like really obsessed for a while, and I just started drinking a lot of tea and all different kinds of tea. You could like, try it to see, but depending if it was in like airtight containers, it might still be good. I have one that's like an old tea Havana that I keep trying to make taste mm-hmm. right, but I think I'm gonna have to. Yeah. <laughs> Right. Also, Esther came in and said before. I know. I was I- just looking. I was like, Ah, hello, hello, Esther. How are you? Um, and everybody was like obsessed with Roy because Roy's amazing. There were so many highs to Roy. Wee. <laughs> um, RJ, hello. Finished creating and editing in progress. Okay, but I think that was the last comment that we left off on. Am I right? Before we went, oh, and then uh, Des said still editing the video, but her favorite drink was the uh, toffee nut hot cocoa. Excellent. And uh, let me, I think I got everybody's because we ended on the starred ones with Nick with the eggnog, which they're with, (laughs) but not with the alcohol. But I'm not an alcohol drinker either, so I get that. I get that. Um... Boop, boop, boop. Can anybody else have any progress? Did I miss any progress, guys, that we needed? Yeah. Right. Yes. Exactly. At least said cinnamon tea. Mm. I have a tea that just arrived today that I'm going to try tonight. Ooh, what what's the flavor? I love Celestials. That looks like fun. Yeah. I don't know what I mean. Holiday, Ooh, tea. holiday tea is. Ginger My bread. gingerbread tea just arrived today, too. It's cinnamon, oh chicory, ginger, carob. Ooh. Ooh. I might have to pick one of those up. Oh. That sounds yum. All right. Now, don't don't panic. Don't Uh-oh. panic. I'm going, you know, I keep the timer going so I know how long we've been chatting. <laughs> we've only been chatting for 15 minutes. That's not bad for us. Mm-hmm. That, uh, honestly. Oh, All right, you, sir. <laughs> so let me do it, Regina. Do it. Oh. What's she doing? I can't look at it and start the timer at the same time. Uh, what's she's she thinking about buying a Christmas banner to add cheer to her living room. Yes, yes. definitely. I, I agree. Perfect. Do it. Do it. Mm-hmm. Do it. My extremely like scrumbly Christmas tree is definitely making me happy. So <laughs> yeah. Aww. Yeah, I didn't have a Christmas tree for the office, so I got this little tiny oh, little white one. And I'm like, you. it does. It just makes you happier to have it in the room. Like, yay. I don't know why. 
And then this is Loki's Christmas present. He can't play with this one. He can play with the other one. This one he has to wait. So it's sitting right there. He got two, but we, we couldn't wait for the other one. He wanted it so bad. So are you guys ready to sprint? Sure. My arms oh, were occupied. Yay. Oh. In a good way. So yay. <laughs> Puppy cuddles. Yeah. Roy's like a 45 minute cuddle sprint. We're here for it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> In three, two, one. Happy sprinting. Can I just walk in that sprint? JC, everybody needs to sprint though. I know, but I, I, don't, I don't run well. Can I walk? Okay. <laughs> yes, you may. You may walk instead of sprint. Sprint walk. They're right there. It's part of your 45 minutes. I know. She wants the 45. Uh, <laughs> me and Mia are not riding today. Me and Mia aren't riding today. So. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> But I could work on some art. Oh, or journaling. There we go. Yes. Crafty stuff.
All right, everybody, welcome back. How did you do? That was a timer from the fabulous Laura Nettles. <laughs> I finished. Yay. Yay. How was it? How was it? Oh, it was good. Yay. Yeah. Laura, you were so into that book. I was like, she, she ain't need check. Did you check the private chat? I did after I finished the book. Okay. <laughs> I, I fixed the document. So, okay. yes. Because they're, they're like, they were like, I'm trying to get her attention. <laughs> I'm like, um, <laughs> put it in the live chat a while ago. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> the book's uh, uh, book better. It's so good. <laughs> Nia, did you hey, see it? It for took you turns I was not expecting. Oh, hang on. I, I caught the points for Laura. Oh. Mm. I, I yeah, did. don't worry yet. Don't worry. Yet. Like okay. It. Sorry. These numbers I see. I won't do it again. <laughs> oh, how did you do? Um, yeah, I um I didn't actually do any writing, but I uh my friend gave me a crock pot a while ago, so I put some stuff in and I'm making a chili for later. So mm. that's fun. But yeah, I'll productive. I guess I count that as productive, you know. Yeah, we'll count that as productive. Yeah, of course it is. It's it's yeah. working your way towards sustenance. That's productive. Yes, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Laura, this one's for you from Grayson's Bookmark. It's called Black Paradox by Junji Ito. Mm -hmm. So good. Look at that cover. <laughs> yes. The, uh, well, the back reads, I saw it, a dazzling world. Yes, another world. I'm sure it was this. I'm sure I saw a world that was not this one. Mm -hmm. And hello, Roselle came in. I have to actually write something. That's okay. That is all right. Some of us are being more productive than others tonight. <laughs> <laughs> and Joanne said, I'm still researching for Project Sugar and Spice, trying to come up with a new opening line. I know. I hate opening lines. I'm like, I feel like, like when you hear a really good one, you're just like, ah, oh, why can't I come up with something like that? Yeah. Just like, why? There's this, like opening line to one of, there's this opening line to one of James Patterson's books. And out of all of his books, and y'all know how much I love James Patterson. This is the one I'll remember. And I don't, I'm not even sure what book it's from yet. Um, I can't remember which book it's from. But the first line is, um, uh, the last thing I remember seeing before I died or something. Oh my God, I can't even remember the line all the way. But it, I was like, wait, what? You died? <laughs> huh? <laughs> I was like, what? Right? Right. Oh, that is such an awesome line. I need to write something like that. Get the bot. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Oh, ugh. It's got it. oh, Nick got it. Nick got it. Ooh, thank you, Nick. Ooh, boo to the, to the, to the, yeah. Y'all know who y'all are. We don't want y'all here. <laughs> um, since that started new artwork for the spring. Yay. I love the sketch. Yes. You got this. I need to do some sketching too. I have a couple of commissions. I still got to finish. <sighs> work, work. Why? Uh, <laughs> at least it's artwork. So it's not so bad. Um, Cause I lost my mouse. Oh, nope, nope. There we go. Uh, this is what I have so far. A baking is a lot like trying to solve a jigsaw puzzle. The pieces, just like the ingredients, individually don't make sense, but combined, they can create something magical. Oh, I like it. Yeah, baking is a lot like solving. Yeah, that's cute. Yeah. Oh, that's the back of the book. That's what you have for the um, back of the book. Oh, was that the first line? Or is that the first line? I oh, think okay. that's the first one. Either way, so it sounds amazing. I yeah, so I think it introduces yeah, I, it. It, it does work. have, it, I get that kind of cozy rom-com kind of feel with it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like it. Something I like magical. It. I, th I think you're on to something, yeah. Joanna. Or Joanna. Yes, yes, I like it. Uh, it's okay that you keep saying hi, Joanne. You're so valid. <laughs> that's so cute. <laughs> but like, sorry, I keep saying hi. <laughs> <laughs> no, energy is good. Yes. <laughs> okay, we're at yes. 
Sparrow is my favorite and one. Oh. Oh yeah, the one about his cats, yeah. I think that's the one I'm gonna dive into. I'm like, what's the not scary one? The one about his cats. Because <laughs> the artwork looks so cool. I'm like, I wanna read it, but also yeah. I'm gonna be scared and have nightmares. <laughs> yeah, Uzumaki is still my favorite. Hmm. Okay, let's see. RJ says 962 new words in the current writing project. Like it so much. Look at you being actually productive. And thank you, Regina, for reporting. <laughs> yeah, never worry about keep saying hi. I have, I like say hi all the time. <laughs> high five, high five back. <laughs> Y'all are so cute. Um, yeah, it was another one. See, Holly likes it as, as well. I like it. Hello, Heather. How are you? If it's missing something, you'll you'll hear it. But it sounds good to me. Like, yeah, are you, to me. like, yeah, sounds good to me. Nick said yeah, they finished I, notes ooh. in chapter one and two. Ooh -hoo. Oh, something else like you want to compare it to something other than a jigsaw puzzle. Is there something mm -hmm. like relevant in the rest of the story, like a? an image or a motif that is like brought up later on that you can compare it to. Yeah, that's what I would say. I like if the jigsaw puzzle thing though. It's unique. I've never heard of it being compared to like, but it fits. It does mm -hmm. fit. Yeah, it is like putting all the pieces together in the right, yeah. you know, they got to go in the right spot. So it, mm -hmm. it makes sense. Yeah. Yeah, no, I think that I, I don't even think that there's anything that's necessarily wrong with it because it sounds good. It's just that I feel like if it's like I am with, with that person, is it just never feels good enough and you need other people to tell you that, yeah, that, that's it. That's a good first line because otherwise yeah. I'm constantly like, no, it's not, it's not good enough. What's missing? I'm always second guessing um, that, that first line, especially that like that opener. Um, and other people could be like, no, that is a great first line. But you're like, but is it? So yeah, yeah. it sounds great. It sounds great. So but you know, I had to go look up that line that I was just couldn't Ooh, remember. What right? is it? <laughs> it, it says, to the best to the best of my understandably shaky recollection, the first time I died, it went something like this. That's the first time <laughs> I was like, oh, so wait, what? Yeah, you died. the first time you died. Wait. <laughs> Yeah, that's amazing. I was like, I need to write first. Oh, okay. Because why can't I oh, okay. Do so even better, the jigsaw puzzle mm -hmm. actually actually really does fit. See? Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Yeah. If she does that jigsaw puzzles, to keep it like that. Like if that's something yep. she does, then it goes with her character. So yep, exactly. Yeah. exactly. From the editor herself talking. Yeah, <laughs> I'm just enjoying. Also, if you I need totally an editor, agree. I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> That line is genius. All right, so you guys, does anybody have an answer for um, the cookie, cake, or pie? All right, which one are you? Nick says, why can't I have them all? I want less pie, but I will not turn it down unless it's pumpkin or key lime. Otherwise, I would like a piece of cake. I love cake and cookies and pie this holiday. Yeah, I, I will actually take them all. I love cake, but I really love cookies at the holidays. But I love cake, but cookies also. But you I too, I will not turn down pie unless it's pumpkin. So, agreed. Same. Nick, you need the same. <laughs> Anybody else? I don't like cherry pie. Um... For holidays, for some reason, I'm I lean more towards the pie. It's a holiday thing. I don't know why. Really? Normally, I would be more of a either cake or cookies type of person. Actually, more so brownies. Mm -hmm. But you don't have brownies on the list. Oh. <laughs> but yeah, for some reason, for holidays, I, I like pie. Apple pie with some butter pecan ice cream. I don't like any pie. <laughs> Strawberry rhubarb pie is my favorite. It's so good. It has like a crumble topping. I'm just mm -hmm. my mom makes it so good. But we also do French silk pies, which is basically a chocolate mousse pie. Oh, those Ooh. are yummy. Yeah, that sounds so good. Yeah, those yeah. are really yummy. I would say like cookies to me feel most like 
Christmassy, but in like in general, like cookies or pie, I'm like a fan. Is it because yeah. you leave cookies out for Santa? <laughs> I do. No. I did actually make cookies the other day, and I have since eaten them all. So. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so wait a minute, Morgan, you used to leave cookies out for Santa too? I still do. What do you mean? <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Cookies with a glass of milk. Yeah. No, we talked about this. I feel like I was like literally afraid of Santa. Like not actually, <laughs> but kind of. Because <laughs> it's just the old man that breaks into your house in the middle of the night. And we like, old I man didn't man see man it like him. that. I never saw it like that. I always saw it as someone bringing gifts to the needy, to children yeah. who couldn't otherwise afford it. And I just didn't think about the whole breaking in. The house. No, that's, like, that. that's probably how it should be seen. But also, I'm just like, but this is a bit sus. Like, <laughs> I mean, it is when you get older and think about it. But <laughs> yeah. yeah, I did go through a phase where I where I questioned this, but I was like, hey, he's giving something away, so I'm just don't overthink it. That's why I told myself, mm, yeah, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Just gonna shove himself through your chimney. It's, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> oh my gosh. Elise says, Cookie Monster here. Every kind of cookie that I can make. I do love. I. Uh, what are the sugar cookies? The ones that you um, you push them out and they're like ah. Uh, the name of them is like slipping my mind, but they're little sugar. Cookies. Yeah, yeah. No, not the thumbprint. The um. But uh, if you use if you you use like the little cookie squeezer out and you make like three dots of them or four, like you make them into a star oh, and then they bake together. I know what you're talking about. I know I don't know the name of it, but I know. Those are so know what yummy. They're buttery about. and sweet. They're like a. They're so good. They're like little biscuity cookies, but they're. I, wish mm, I, can remember the name. I cannot it, think of the name. They're spritzels. Let me see what Google says. Hold Something on. like that. <laughs> yes, I think they're. Yeah, I think that's what they are. Those are so yummy. But I feel like I can like eat them all. They're, you know, they're just that kind of cookie where you just feel like you're just going to eat them all. <laughs> I love cookies. Okay, let me stop. And does this <laughs> cookies for sure. All right, let me go back to the regular chat. Because uh, uh, I lost where I'm at. Oh, I, my mom used to do those too. They're yum. What are they? What is? I believe they're the little the um. Well, my mom called them pedifers. If they're the same thing, the little tiny. They're like little tiny cakes. Ooh, okay. And sometimes they're dipped in a like a, a white chocolate or a, like a white icing. But they're like it's. I don't even know what the point of them is. They're so tiny. Like <laughs> it's so time consuming. <laughs> oh my god. I'm a cake person, especially my own coconut. Ooh, I do love a good coconut cake. Mm, okay, so I did say I Google like doesn't, Google doesn't even know what I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but, oh yes, and I love fudge. So just whatever you love. This question <laughs> is not like a would you rather. You can literally throw in anything and you can have them all or none, but preferably them all. And anything else you can add in. Fudge is delicious. So every Christmas we would make plates and plates mm -hmm. of truffles and coconut <sighs> indulgences, which is basically mm -hmm. coconut and sweetened condensed milk truffle thing that you mm -hmm. dip with chocolate. So oh. I'm surprised at how much people bake. Because the only cookies we ever made were like Pillsbury oh. <laughs> Place and bake cookies. You see, they're all over for making cakes and pies. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Fritz cookies or Italian butter cookies? Not mm -hmm. entirely sure. I believe they're the Fritz. Hold on, let me look it up. As we would also build our gingerbread houses from scratch. Like I would make yeah, the dough the and bake it. <laughs> like, wait a minute. Oh. Yeah, Tiffany had it right. It's the Fritz. Is cookies. it like this? Hang on, hang on. Do, 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 do. I think that's a, a thumbprint. I don't know. I don't know cookies. Those are yeah. thumbprints, right? Okay. Yeah, I think those are thumbprints. 
But they look like they, yeah. they, they came out of the they, squeeze thing, like you said. That's, that's yeah, they do it. come out of the squeeze thing, but a lot of times you either press your thumb in them or you put something on top of them, like a nut or a piece okay. of chocolate or something like that. Um, but yeah, this, the, the difference with the spritz is I guess that's why they call them spritz is that you to get them to get them to look like a flower it's like you make one little dot and you take okay. a dot around and then one dot in the middle and then when it bakes it comes together to make it look like a, a flower or whatever it is and they're just oh. so yummy and they yeah, are sugar those, cookies. Um, those butter cookies growing up the ones that have like where you can put them on your finger um Ooh, like a yes. ring yes i, used I feel like yes. that yes. 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 <laughs> Well, I used to love those so much. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, goodness. Another one with the no cherry pie. So my husband, my brother, and my sister, they love cherry pie. And the rest of us, we're just like, okay, on cherry pie. And they used to get so mad because we'd only make one cherry pie. And then everybody would eat it. And they'd be like, you guys don't even like the cherry pie. So we started making them each their own cherry pie so that they could not complain. <laughs> wow. And they were like, you can take your, you can take your cherry pie home with you. Because I'm the pie maker. So I was like, well, I guess we're making more cherry pie. I mean, I'll <laughs> eat a cherry pie, but it's not like it's my favorite. So, but if it's there, I'm going to eat it. But my brother's like, but there's pecan, apples, like three different kinds of apples. He goes, why are you going to eat that? And I'm like, that oh. does make sense. Why do, I think it's because there's only one. So you want to get your slice. So it's okay. been much better since we made sure everybody gets one. <laughs> <laughs> You get a pie and you get a pie. You get a pie. Everybody gets a pie. <laughs> I'm like, I'm I'm here. I'm making them what kind of pie you want. I'll take a lemon meringue. <laughs> my mom makes an amazing lemon meringue pie. But my one of my sons is like, I don't like the meringue. I'm like, oh, don't eat the meringue. That's I don't fine. either. I like a I like a lemon pie, but I'm not big on the meringue. I'll take an yeah, apple. apple. I'll take an apple with the crumble on top. Oh, mm -hmm. yes. Oh, my God. I literally think I'm going to make an apple crumble later, like around Christmas or oh. something. I love them. Mm -hmm. It's just like an apple pie, but easier to make. And just yeah, it really is. is. And then the top of the topping is so here's, sweet. And yummy. Here's how much of a baker I am not. I will go buy <laughs> Mrs. Smith's apple pie in the frozen food section and then I will put it in the salad. It's fine. Yeah, a lot of Frozen apple pies are like accidentally vegan, so that I feel like a lot of like oh really vegans, myself included will just be like I'll just buy this like in case I need oh, a dessert or whatever. Yeah, there's, I don't remember what brand. There's one brand in the U.S. that's like a fairly well-known brand that's accidentally vegan, and there's like a brand in Australia <laughs> too that's like yeah, it's oh. like vegan by chance. It's like it was the same. Oh, yeah. I can I, I can eat vegan. more pie because I can say I'm eating healthy. It's vegan. <laughs> <laughs> Exactly. Jennifer, I think I'm going to introduce this Perfect. to my daughter because Perfect. she loves all three yeah. of these things and this might be her new thing she might start making. That's awesome. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, I missed one. She said Rainier cherry pie, rhubarb custard is the best. And another one. I don't like cherries at all. So definitely no cherry pie. I like like uh, fresh cherries, but I don't really like like cherry flavor or anything. Yeah. I like the real I yeah, I, I like the fresh cherries. They're yummy. I'm the same about strawberries. I mm. like fresh strawberries. Well, yeah. for some reason I do not like strawberry flavored things. Wait, take that back. I like strawberry milk. But uh <laughs> <laughs> I don't like banana flavored things. I don't, I don't like, like maraschino cherries. I don't like bananas, bananas at all. Delicious. Except for banana pudding, I'm sorry, but yeah, I don't like bananas. Well, isn't it the thing that like banana flavor is like what bananas used to taste like, and then like they've evolved so much that like the actual probably. bananas we eat daily. Them? I don't 100 percent know, but yeah, yeah. probably. Yeah, I think uh, fungus or something took out most of the banana crop, and so yeah. the one that survived is the one we have now. Oh wow! Did you say fungus? A disease. That's wild. Don't like cherry themselves, but love the cherry flavors. Yeah, I like yeah. cherry flavors, but I don't like cherries. What? 
This is yeah. amazing. No cherry pie for me, no but apple pie is. Yeah, mm-hmm. apple pie is where it's at. Yes. But I think I'm just shocked at the number of people who don't like cherry pie. I can eat cherry pie, but I have to be in the mood for it. Like, I, it, it has to be like something I'm like craving a cherry pie for some reason. It won't won't happen often, but every now and then. I like yeah, I, I don't like-, like banana flavoring, but my mom used to make um, a homemade banana pudding and I will eat that. I don't know if it's that saying like it's made with love, but for some reason that banana flavoring I will eat, but on general, like when there would be like banana flavored candy or popsicles, I'm like, oh, I'm scared of the yellow ones. I'm like, is it lemon or pineapple? <laughs> yeah. I need someone else to taste it first to make sure it's not banana. Yeah. Wait, I'll eat cherry pie. Pie. I feel like eating a cherry pie is like the vibes of when like, you're a detective in like the 80s or the 90s or something and you like go into a diner and you like have your black coffee with like a piece of cherry pie and then you like go out to solve a murder there you go that is a vibe, like, that's that's the vibe of the pie. waffles waffles with ice cream is so good but i saw my mom mm. doing this and i didn't know what i was like what are you doing uh but she, yeah and she put like butter and syrup in the ice cream and whipped cream i was like and it's so good she goes taste it and i was like oh it's amazing. If you have not had uh, waffles with ice cream, do it. You will be shocked. Have yeah, you heard? Especially I don't know if this place is around, but there is an ice cream place here that um, the their waffle cones are actual waffles. They're like full. They're so like waffles and then filled with ice cream. It's so good. Really? Yeah, like bubble waffle or yes. yeah, bubble waffles are <laughs> everywhere. Oh. Yeah, I forgot what the store is called, but yeah, That's I think so bubble waffles scary. originated in Hong Kong. But. Delicious. Yeah. yeah so I if you it. have not had it, I highly recommend. So good. All right. And Disney World, you can get bubble waffles where the bubbles are Mickey shaped. Ooh. <laughs> not that I'm a nerd. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go into spread to number number three. And the question is, are you ready for 2023? Are you still in disbelief? <laughs> it's almost here. <laughs> I still have to make oh, my boy. Christmas presents. Ah. Oh, I mean, yeah. You there's get on it. We have days. We have oh, days. Lord. No, no, no. I'm going to start over. Don't worry. I promised you guys 25. Or... What, yeah, didn't I say 30, 25? 30? No, you said 30. Um, <laughs> did I say 30? You said did 25. I, did I say no, 25? You said 25 if it was Laura's timer that she was going to use for the 25 minute. All right, we'll we'll split split it. The second one. Um, we'll split it. Let's go with 28. Oh. And, or until JC stops talking. <laughs> we can talk for the next three minutes. <laughs> How rude. How rude. I'm going to kill Tanner Boys. Oh. I'm letting you, they say I'm letting you determine how long the sprint is. <laughs> I guess she says we can start now. So happy sprinting. <laughs> happy sprinting, everyone. 27 minutes and 30 seconds. Oh, no, she unmuted. I feel disrespected. <laughs> we love you, JC. We look forward to the banter.
Woohoo! We did it. Or as Tiffany's timer says, we did the dang thing. <laughs> Unless you're me, I didn't do much. No, I, I actually did some journaling. So I was doing some journaling, uh, getting my Q1 ready for 29 or 2019. Someone said 2019 thing. And I'm like, yeah. I'm right there with you. Yeah, I can, mm -hmm. yeah, like redo anyway. But yeah, for 2023. Oh, here it comes. How did you guys do? And you guys let me know in the chat. What did you guys get done tonight? Did you get did you get anything done tonight? Some of you did. I saw some progress over these past couple sprints. Yeah, I journaled, so caught up. So I'm on today now. I was a day and a half behind. Yeah. I have a hard time if I miss days, I'm like, I have a hard time going back and getting caught up. Unless I missed because it was like important stuff going on. I'm like, oh, I want to get that in there. But if I miss because like nothing was going on, I'm like, yeah, I'm not going back <laughs> to write that nothing. <laughs> I did nothing. That's why I wrote nothing. Yeah. <laughs> I, do, um, oh, oh, no, go ahead, Anna. Uh, fine. This is unimportant. <laughs> I spent like way too long sending Nick like many books that I like. Like I just sent him so them so many ebooks, so they will have reading material for the next like all of twenty twenty three. But then I did a little bit of writing, so editing. Um, I I was working on list of things for twenty twenty three, but um. Yeah, I, that's about it. <laughs> Very cool. I got sleepy, so I went and laid down. <laughs> that sounds like that's a plan. So mm -hmm. Yep, that's legit. Absolutely. I got through eight chapters tonight. Oh, nice. Right. That's good. That's great. Nice. Yeah. yeah. And I just did some journaling, like I said. Let's see. In our chat, we had a uh, sin finish the sketch and basic line work. Yay! Nice, so good. So good. I feel like I'm so behind, but that's fine. That's fine. <laughs> so, I said, I'm still getting some research done. Oh, you like the character outlines? I like those. Um, oh, this one is for our question, but let me really quick. quick. I have far bigger TBR now. Thank you, <laughs> Anna. <laughs> And Nick says, I'm in chapter three, the uh, retreat chapter, retreat <laughs> chapter three. Still working on the notes for that one. Excellent. Excellent. All right. Um, so let me go through our, I have them starred. Joanna said, I'm still in disbelief that it's almost here. Yeah, I'm pretty much there too. But I'm trying to get ready at the same time. Holly says, I'm ready for 2023. It did sneak up on me though. Yeah, I feel that. Since I have no reply to any question because I've lost all concept of time this past <laughs> year. And I've accepted that. Um, but I'm ready for whatever comes my way. And also order a typewriter, which comes next week. Oh, that's exciting. That that's is awesome. very cool. Yeah. And just the idea of typing a novel. Oh, my gosh. Yes. It's the coolest thing. Ever. It, that sounds really cool. It really does. Um, and Nick says, 100% disbelief. I just keep ignoring the fact that it's like around <laughs> the corner. I feel that. <laughs> <laughs> and Des says, both. I'm ready for it, but in complete disbelief that 2022 mm -hmm. came, blinked, and is now like <laughs> almost gone. Yes. And um, wait, it's not 2019. I'm like feeling that so strongly, Elise. Yeah. 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 Like really, really. And then Jennifer said, I'm for sure ready for 2023. Yes, somebody's a really, really, I love that. Is All right. How about I feel that? like I'm more on the route to being prepared for 2023 than I am for Christmas, even though Christmas is like two weeks away. <laughs> I'm like, I could, Christmas could wait. I can handle New Year's. <laughs> Christmas needs to wait. <laughs> yeah, 
I, I, I literally told my kids because my kids have a, a budget for us. And so I said, get your Christmas list ready. And they're like, mom, we, we did our Christmas list. I'm like, okay, so it's just me. <laughs> the, problem is, the problem is me. I have not looked at your Christmas list. Okay. Because <laughs> I told them that, like after Thanksgiving, I'm like, guys, make sure that your, your um, Christmas lists are in so I know what what you guys want. So they make a big list and I'll, I'll pick a couple things and I tell them prioritize what, you know, what you really want. So I know if you really want something, I don't want to get something from the bottom of the list. And you're like, but why did you get this for the same price that you could have got me the number one thing? So I'm like, please prioritize. Um, but yeah, they all told me today that they already had their list ready. And I'm like, that's sorry. Forget okay. I said anything. I'm still that, trying to figure out Christmas dinner. Like, I'm just like, I don't even know. <laughs> Yeah. Well, just maybe eat some food. I have no idea. Not just like not cherry pie, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Let me share my screen. So these are what I'm going to be making. I have the supplies. I just need to actually do it now. Oh, gorgeous! Yay! So that's my inspiration. Oh, you will show us, right? What's we'll done? Right? Yeah. Yeah. Yay! Okay, so I have I have the clear ornaments, I have the paint and everything. I just need to do it. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. What type of paint do you use for that? Is it just basic acrylic or is it um I have acrylic, but I also have pouring medium to put in it so that mm -hmm. it won't crack when it's in the inside. Mm-hmm. Cool. Yes. So, ooh, those are pretty. Yeah. And then Des says, yes, so freaking weird that it's it's very true. I'm like, I don't even know what's happening. Rachel, hello. We're almost done. Bye. Um, not even close to being ready for the new year, but I'm like, the energy of a new year. Yeah. I, I'm excited for it. I'm like, yeah, but... I just can't believe that 2022 is over. Like, it's just, it's a weird, weird place to be. Look yeah. at you. Essie finished Christmas shopping today. Felt good because I hate shopping. I do too. I'm not a shopper. <laughs> yes, they're always, yes, they always stress me out. Like, my kids, you like, you got to make me a list. You can't hint because I will miss that hint. No matter how many times you hint that you like something, something's pretty. I'm like, yeah, it is pretty, and I'm gonna keep on rolling. <laughs> if you don't tell me you liked it, I don't know. I am bad. I'm like, they're like, remember when I mentioned? I'm like, yeah, I remember you said that that was cool. You didn't say you wanted it. Hello. I always <laughs> tell my 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 family or friends, I'm easy for Christmas. Give me an Amazon gift card. Or some planners. We're good. <laughs> That's all I really want. <laughs> I tell my family that all the time. And they still get me just random things. I'm like, I told you. Get me a book, a gift card, something, a notebook, some pens. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yep, you can, yeah, you can get me any of those things and, I, and I'm good. Mm -hmm. um, Joanne, I think... It depends on how many you need for the chapter. Like, I don't, like, I don't talking, know either a set number. Talking yeah, names? like characters? Are, yeah, or? are you trying to name people? Because if you're trying to name people, yeah. you feel like you're, like, constantly name dropping so that we know who is who. Um, yeah, that might be a bit much. That, Unless you're writing, like, an ancient Greek tragedy, then it doesn't really matter. <laughs> like... <laughs> Okay, so yeah. let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, approximately. Because she says, I have Lydia, her parents, Aiden, her ex-boyfriend, but good friend, Twya, maybe, um, her roommate, and Xavier. So, so you like just want to sprinkle them in, like introduce yeah. them as, as needed, as the conversation is happening. Like, so... If you if they're all if you're saying that they're all coming in on this one chapter, let's say you've got Lydia and she's talking to her parents, and so she'll have that conversation. So now we know that the parents are there, and if you need to mention their names, dad the dad can call the mom, you know whatever the mm -hmm. mom's name is, and vice versa, because Lydia is obviously going to call the mom and dad. Um, and then as Aiden comes in, 
they could, you know, just a uh, hey Aiden or you know or Aiden if if Aiden's good uh, her ex boyfriend but good friend, um, yeah, just sprinkle it in. Aiden comes in, you know, and whatever Aiden's doing, you're gonna just mention that Aiden's doing the thing. So now we've got Aiden thing. You don't have to say and this is Aiden, Aiden, you know, just as long as it flows and we don't feel like. You're, you're, we're not feeling like you're coming into the chapter and says Lydia enters the kitchen and her mom so and so's there, her dad so and so. Just don't do it like that. Just sprinkle them in. Yeah. yeah, and stuff like I feel like the parents will probably have a, some sort of relationship with the ex boyfriend. So, like, they can have like a small interaction that maybe suggests that he's the ex. Like, I don't know. There's like basically what Nia said. But yeah. And I would also say make sure everyone is there for a reason. Because usually they're not just people standing around watching you have a conversation with somebody else. So if it's just about like, because she said it should focus on Lydia and Xavier. So why is everyone else there? Are they just yeah. watching them talk? <laughs> like, maybe they could all be she together. The beta, reader, the beta reader said it was too many characters in that chapter and that it should focus on mm -hmm. it's Lydia. Okay. And like, if they okay. have to... That you can have them all in the house together, but then have Lydia and Xavier pair off in a room to have a mm -hmm. conversation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So even in passing or something. Yeah. Like I just did a, I had to count it out, but I did a scene. It was like five people, but it was the two main characters and then their parents and they were having breakfast. So everybody was busy. Like the two moms were cooking, you know, like the dad, he had a moment like talking to the son. Then there was like moments where other people were talking. Not everybody was talking at once. Yeah. So, you know, like Morgan said, make sure you know what everybody's doing and why they're there. Like they serve a purpose. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, Rachel, let you finally figure out a song I need to write to progress the chapter. Ooh. I love songs and stories. Um, um, <laughs> I love stuff. Oh. <laughs> yep. That's a good one. And Rizal says, I'm the same way. I'm just like, send me the list. Oh, yeah. I'll choose from there. Exactly. <laughs> Don't give me hints. I will <laughs> miss it. I will not know what the heck you're talking about. And then you'll be very disappointed when you just get your gift card. Unless what you really wanted was a gift card, then hint all day long because you couldn't get a gift card. <laughs> no, yeah. Then someone will be like, wow, I would really love to have a gift card. And then you'd like get them something. <laughs> my aunt's like that. And one year for my birthday, I told her that I wanted this. Um, there was like one of those little electronic game things that was like Wheel of Fortune. And I think it was $19 or something like that. And I wrote electronic wheel of fortune and she went to target and just handed the guy the list and was like, this is what she wants. And he sold her a uh, um, Nintendo like portable game thing for a hundred bucks <laughs> and the cartridge for the, the uh, wheel of fortune. And so she's like, is this right? <laughs> I was like, oh, no, so but it's better, no. so I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! It's like that worked in your favor, but okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and wrap it up because oh my gosh, it's almost ten o'clock. What? Um, you guys, we're gonna let everybody know what we're doing, what we got coming up really quick so we can tell the folks good night and let them get on with their evening and Anna get on with the rest of her day. Um, let's start with Anna while we're at it. We'll go swing it backwards around this time. Anna. Hello, I'm Anna or the Ant Hugger uh, around the internet. I am a PhD student and a writer of many different things. And thanks. <laughs> Tiffany. Um, hi, I'm Tiffany, TL Rest Lifestyle. Um, you can catch me on Thursday for PJs and Scribbles. And um, you can always go check out my Kindle Vella called Come Find Her. And on Monday, I will be doing a live reading of the first story in my new Christmas story, A Town Called Christmas. Aww. And in theory, tomorrow, the cover art and everything will be out for that. Okay. And, you know, the... <laughs> Live stream will be up. Yay! All that type of stuff. <laughs> Love it. Uh -huh. A homey little place. 
I'm excited. You guys are going to love it. Okay. Hello, everyone. My name is Morgan Lee. Um, what I have coming up, I have my book is coming out on December 16th. I am. I will be doing some launch week stuff next week. Stay tuned for details on what that will be. Um, and yeah, that's it. That's, that's all I'm going to promote. Tonight. <laughs> that's it. Uh, I'm author JC Carpenter. I have books. I make videos. I do things. I stream tomorrow from 7 to 9 p.m. So come join us. And yep, that's me, Laura. <laughs> I'm Laura. Surprise! <laughs> um, I write spooky things and vampire romancy things, and I finished reading a book tonight. So <laughs> hooray! Um, I will be around places. You'll see. Me. <laughs> yeah, I'm like a ghost. I can't get rid of me. <laughs> Wouldn't want to. Yeah, oh. ghost you'd want to be haunted by. So cool. <laughs> and I am Nia the Vixen Fiction. You're here on my channel. I'm here every Tuesday night at 7 p.m. I'm all over the place with these lovely people that you see. And the, I am streaming on Friday at noon. I'll be on with the other Laura and Zara Hoffman um, on my channel for some lunchtime sprints. So, yeah, come hang out. Follow everybody here on the screen. They're really cool people. And if you have met somebody in the chat go ahead and give them a follow too because people here are really super nice and i'm gonna find my banner so that we don't have to wave all night we're gonna say <laughs> good night bye, bye.